Are you thinking about buying a used boat or camper this summer so you don't have to deal with hotel rooms or airports? Well, before you start shopping, consumer reporter John Matarese has a warning after a Claremont County woman lost thousands of dollars. In this year of COVID, many of us are trying to avoid crowds, so buying a boat or a camper for your family may sound like a great idea, as long as you don't get scammed. Tracy Beers is a single mom and watercolor artist who wanted a way to spend more time outdoors. We like to camp and fish and all that kind of stuff. Tracy's dream was to take her kids boating and camping this summer to avoid the risk of COVID-19 in a hotel room. But she found dealers too expensive. So she turned to Facebook Marketplace, where she found much better deals. There, she spotted this 2011 pontoon boat for just $1,800, along with a camper for only $1,000. So she messaged the seller, asking why the price was so low. Uh, husband died three months ago. They need to get rid of it. It was just too many memories. That made sense. Also giving her confidence, the seller was using eBay to handle the transaction with a request for eBay gift cards as payment. Give them the numbers when you scratch off the back. The contract promised eBay's protection. We're not going to give the person the money until the product has been delivered. But after spending almost three grand on gift cards, the seller ghosted her. The number was changed. Tracy had fallen victim to what's called the Facebook Marketplace scam. The ad had been stolen, then reposted at a much lower price. That 2011 pontoon boat for $1,800, we found the same model for $18,000. What do you think of people putting this scam together? I think it's horrible that they're doing it, and I, I'm hoping that I can help someone else. Whether you're buying a boat, camper, or car, be suspicious if the price is too low, especially if you can't see it in person. So don't waste your money. I'm John Matters, WCPO, 9 News.